Hey, welcome everyone. In this video, we're going to learn a device to help us convert opioids while in the hospital. So we're mainly going to discuss morphine, oxycodone, and Dilaudid. Now, I found this method to be better, faster, and more convenient than using the opioid conversion calculators. That's mainly because I can never find them when I go on Google. So if you look at this diagram, if you can memorize this, that's all you really need to know. So three arrows, the numbers three, four, and five, and then you have to know that IV is on the left and PO is on the right, and then morphine is on top and dilaudid is on the bottom. So directionality of the arrows is the other important thing because when you go with the arrows, you're going to multiply, and when you go against the arrows, you have to divide. But this is really all you need to know. So let's uh, go over an example here. So converting morphine 10 milligrams IV to PO. So here you're going to start on top and in the left. So IV is on the left side, morphine's on the top. So we start there and our multiplier is 3. So we multiply 10 milligrams by 3 and our answer is 30 milligrams oral. So 10 milligrams of IV morphine equals 30 milligrams of oral. So question number 2. Morphine 30 milligrams PO equals how much oral dilaudid. So now we're going to start on the right side since we're talking about orals. We're still on top because it's morphine. But this time we divide. So we divide because we're going against the arrow. and We want to get down to PO dilaudid. So 30 divided by 4, our answer is 7.5 milligrams. And then if we want to go from all the way to IV dilaudid, what are we going to do? Yeah, we're going to divide by 5. So 30 milligrams PO morphine is equivalent to 1.5 milligrams of IV dilaudid. All right, next example. So dilaudid 1.5 milligram IV, how much PO morphine? So now we're just going in the other direction. So this time we're going with the arrow uh, to PO, and then we're going with the arrow again. So multiplied by 5 times 4. And our answer is 30. So the last part of this is oxycodone. So oxycodone is not actually on here. So that takes an additional step, but it's not that far of a stretch. So if you want to get to oxycodone, you got to kind of follow the arrows until you get to IV morphine, and then you multiply by 2. So let's go over an example. So dilaudid 15 milligrams IV is going to equal how much PO oxycodone. So I've basically given the answer away um, on the, in the top right here. So you take 15, you multiply by 5 to get from IV dilaudid to PO dilaudid, and then you multiply by 4 to get from oral dilaudid to oral morphine. You divide by 3 because now we're going against the arrow, so we divide. And now we go with the arrow, so our answer 15 milligrams of IV dilaudid equals 200 milligrams of oxycodone. So it's pretty simple. Uh, I, I find it much easier than having to go on to Google, look for a calculator, and especially one that works. So this is pretty standard, uh, these conversion rates. So this is based off uh, this, this graph here. So uh, 10 milligrams of IV morphine equals 20 milligrams of oxycodone equals 30 milligrams of oral morphine. The other thing to know is oxycodone only comes in oral, whereas morphine comes in IV and um, oral, and dilaudid comes in IV and oral. So that's it. So pretty simple. So uh, I learned that a, a long time ago. I still remember it, uh, despite not really using it um, for long periods of time. So I hope this was helpful. And I hope this is faster than some of the online opioid conversion calculators. So thanks a lot. Have a good day.